Right, if you don't like soppy shit, you might want to skip ahead 40 seconds. It's not going to be funny. It's just going to be soppy. Okay. I just want to say thank you, really. Um, the channel, well, for me, has been blowing up. It's been, the last couple of weeks have been ridiculous. I'll, I'll give you some background. Um, I've been doing this a year. And I've been doing really well, I've been really happy. I think over that year I've averaged about sort of 10, 12 subscribers a day, which is really good for a gaming, a new gaming channel. Um, and I was really, really pleased. And I hit 3,000 maybe a month ago-ish. And I said to myself, I was talking to the missus, and I said, right, I'm going to set myself a goal for to hit by New Year, and that would be 5,000 subscribers. So 10 months it took me to get 3,000. I thought I'm going to go big, like aim high, and I thought, 5,000 subscribers. Today, we just hit 4,500. It's been absolutely ridiculous. Um, and this is all down to you guys. Obviously watching and subscribing, because you know that's what I'm basing this on. But the fact that every day that I log into my YouTube, there's a fucking bunch of comments to go through. And I, I try to answer every single person. But the fact that you guys are hitting the like button and subscribing to the video, subscribing to the channel and commenting on the videos means that more people find the videos because that's how YouTube works. You know, you comment, you like, YouTube sees it as interaction and then it finishes higher up in the search for everybody else. And that's how people are finding people. are fi I saw from the comment last video, amazing uh, um, feedback on that, guys. <laughs> right. And I saw that. You know, a ton of people were commenting saying that they were found it either on mainly was suggested videos or they did a particular search, usually for my lead save or Liverpool or Bolton or the Journeyman and stuff like that. And that they're finding it because you guys have liked and commented on it. So thank you. I'm averaging in the last two weeks, I'm averaging 100 subscribers a day, which is just ridiculous. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for making this old bloke. Very, very happy man. It's been amazing. Right. Okay, enough of this soppy shit. Should we get on with the episode? Run the intro. <music> Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to episode 8 of The Journeyman. We've got some bad news. Um, we didn't get top six. It was very unlikely last game after the Ballad double header, even with that win on the second game. But... We didn't quite do enough to catch up, so we uh, beat Bala 1-0, obviously that heroic game. And then we played Connor's Key, which we drew one all with, even despite the, f <laughs> despite the fact we had two men sent off in the 90th minute. I don't know, punch up. Aaron Lemon, the legend that is. Um, sneaky little spoiler alert, we might have an interview with Aaron Lemon tomorrow. So just, just you know, just hop, put that in your caps, remember it, yeah, in your diary. Um... Then we drew with Airbus, uh, Harry Owen getting a 90-second minute equaliser, quite happy with that. And then, so the, then the league split um, into the Welsh Premier League Playoff Conference. And we won 2-1, Harry Owen and Nagy with the goals. Good to see Harry Owen getting back in the goals. Today's a big game because we've got the JD Welsh Cup fourth round. Um, I'll, look at the fix I'll look at the rules because I was looking at the rules for the fourth round, remember, with the prize money, you see. So if we lose today, we get two and a half grand. So not too not too bad really at all for the amount of money we have in the club, um, and then quarter final six grand. See if we can get through six grand would be huge. Look at the money we've got. We're up to twenty grand in the bank. Another six grand. That's a good good chunk of turnover. Um, what we need. To, so I, oh, I just wanted to apologise for you know the start of the video. I was going to do a little funny little skit, and but to be honest, I just want to say thank you to. All the guys that have supported me for this last year, plus all the new guys that have come in in the last two weeks. It's just been amazing. I'm not going to get soppy again. Right, we're just moving on, okay? Um, we have moved back to the the dominator tactic that I use with my Liverpool save. I'm ignoring the fact that I don't have any complete wingbacks and just sort of just telling them to play there. Just, just do it, mate. Just do it. So we have, unfortunately, two players cup-tied. Um, two of our new players cup tied. I'm not sure. If, did I show you Stephen Brat Bowen? We, he's not very good. Uh, <laughs> there you go. You've seen him. He's shit. Um, he's a he's a wing back supposedly, but complete wing back is still confusing the shit out of him. So we need to make some changes here. <clears throat> so Cookie, um, are we on? Are we on game day? 
We're not even on game day. Jesus Christ, Loki, sort your shit out, mate. I was like, why is everybody so unfit? It's because it's not game day. Now we're just going to have to wait. I have every league in Europe loaded. This isn't a quick process. Right. <laughs> just talk amongst yourselves. Talk amongst yourselves for a minute. Yeah, one thing I wanted to talk to you about, guys, is what are our thoughts for next season? I think to get me out of that shithole apartment, I think we need a part-time job, right? I'd kind of like to stay with Cardiff Met Uni another year, but the fact of the matter is we're going to hopefully perform above expectations this year, which is surviving relegation, and we've got our coaching badge C. So I'm hoping we're good enough at this point to get an actual paid position, probably at a part-time club. <clears throat> but let me know what you think. Are we going to be doing that? in the Welsh League, maybe jump up a club in the Welsh League to one of the part-time clubs, or moving abroad, let me know, let me know what you think we should be doing next, guys, um, you know, should I be really hunting for a job, or should I, should I just sort of keep an eye on it, or should I be applying for every job and pissing off Cardiff Met Uni, um, the board are very, uh, pretty pleased, I think, um, very pleased, so they're, they're delighted with me, so I think... I think we need to move on. I want to get out of this apartment. I think there's a guy that's dead in the back. Or just been asleep for a long time. But he's starting to smell kind of funky. So, yeah, we. I think I think we need a paid position. And I'm kind of open to anywhere, really. I don't mind moving abroad. We could do it. Um, Ellis Bellamy. Offer from Airbus. Okay, that's, that's nice for you. I do quite like him. But he won't. Oh, yeah, because I tried to sign him and... Moving on. He wanted like 20, 20 quid a week. I could afford that sort of money. I'm not made of money. Yeah. Right. Conway. In the, Is it Conway? Conway. We'll go with Conway. In the Welsh Cup. We're going to beat these guys. We're going to make some money. And uh, then we're going to beat real. Because that's what we do in these parts. Every win helps us. That's what we've got to think about it. Is It's not just about surviving relegation. The further up the, the league we can finish, the better the job will be That if we do decide to move. I think, like, eventually we could make Cardiff Met Uni a part-time club because we're slowly creeping up in the bank balance. But the trouble is, I don't know how long it's going to take. Um, you can have him. I don't know, just don't know how long that would take. Maybe another three, four years of earning, like, five grand profit a year before we, before we go part-time. So... Um, we'll have a look. We won't look at the job security just yet. We'll do that next episode. We'll start looking at the job security. But let you let me know what 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 area you'd like me to go to manage to. What would be your ideal? Don't pick like Man United, obviously. But you know, within reason, that's likely a country, maybe a league that you think I could get a job in. Um, okay, now we're on game day. Now I've waffled and and filled. So we've got quite a big squad now because I've just been signing players for funsies. Um, Nagy and Owen both scored in their last game, so we'll give them another go. Um, Ian Hill is going to have to fill in a wing back again. Sorry, Ian. But, you know, needs must and all that. Needs must, sir. Right. Um, Owen and Farah just behind the t top two. Daffy and Tom Dodd, who's the other new signing. Carl McCartney left. Ian, 37 year old Ian Hill, a complete wing back. That's going to just confuse the shit out of him, isn't it? Um, we could do with another centre back, so a, a slight issue. But goalkeeper wise, Wilkes is 6.76 in his last five. He's had a little bit of a run of games. Wilfuller 6.72. Rich Morgan 6.78. They're all much of a muchness. I'm going to go for Willis for one more game, I think. Right, come on. We need to beat this little bastard, okay? No messing about. Don't worry about. The fact that nobody's playing in the right position. It's fine. It's fine. Right. Here we go. The teams are warming up. In a world where teams are warming up. No. Right. Cardiff may even have enough quality. Yes, we do. Can we have a quick look at their star man? Jimmy Kelly. Come on. We should beat these, shouldn't we? I feel like these are the games we're just going to get. Bummed. They're playing a four one three two four four one two three four one four one who knows? Who knows? Right. 
I'm going to go confident. I'm going confident. We should be winning this easy, lads. Yeah. Build them up. All right, there's a lot more to come from you. Get some green. Get some green. Go. Right. Another sunny day in Cardiff. It's a little bit cloudy, but take it. The burger vans are out in force. It's cup day. You can see by the big crowd that it's cup day. We've got, I think I saw four people on the far stand there that have turned up. Good. Like friends and family, I imagine. That's, oh my god, that was a lovely pass. Why was that not a highlight? He just pinged it right through to him. He must have miscontrolled it, I guess. Okay, early doors. Move down there. Let's let's play spot the fans. Um, no, that's a cone. Daffy, don't lose it there. Don't lose it there. That's a horrific place to lose it. That's a lovely pass from Daffy McCarthy. <laughs> oh dear, the skills, the skills to pay the bills. Right, yeah, score Daff, score McCarthy. It's a battle those two. Oh Jesus, this is so dodgy passing. This is. Ball over the top for Owen to chase on to. We know what he's like at a finishing. We know what he's like. We oh, it's a good block. He's done what? There's, there's one. There's one up there. And there's two there. Three. Four people. Oh, look at the left-hand side. There's like there's like 20. I don't know why I keep pointing as if you can see me point. There's like a good 30 people on that stand. That must be the way the ultras go. <laughs> the Cardiff Matt Uni ultras. Just probably one bloke with a flair. Right, half an hour gone and nothing much is happening and we're not really in control of this game. And it's a free kick here to Conwy. Don't do this, mate. Don't do this. You, know, you don't need the cup. We do. We need them cut more than you. Oh, come on. That was never a foul ref. He just ran into the back of him and headbutted him in the back. It's fine. Uh, don't send him off, ref. There's nothing like... There's not anything weird going on, is there? Ref, maybe do the first one. Oh, okay, fine. Okay, I feel like they're going to score from that. This has been far too big a build-up to this free kick. Yes, Bell. That's what he's there. The big fucking salmon. Right. We have got it key highlights, haven't we? This hasn't been the most entertaining highlight so far. Right, Barnet. Great tackle from Dodd. Nagy, can he find Owen with a cheeky through ball? He has indeed. Owen's got quite a bit to do, but he's got runners if he wants to... No, no. He doesn't need runners, does he? doesn't fucking need runners because he's fucking Harry Owen. RVD. <laughs> right. Fucking hell. Was not expecting that. We have three runners here. Really nice to see this bit here. But he's just like, no, fuck it. I'm Harry Owen. Eesh. Great goal. That's it. It's good to see Harry Owen back scoring because he was, he's been our main man this season. He's kept us in this league. And hopefully he's going to keep us in the cup. We've only had four shots combined in 36 minutes, so the fans aren't really getting a classic, let's say. But I could not give less of a shit. We're 1-0 up. That's all I care about. It's a results business, yeah? Right. Wow, that was... a. Uh... Interesting half of football, and by interesting, I say not interesting at all. It's boring as shit, but we'll take it. I'd like to go somewhere like not too far away, right? I wouldn't like to go to some sort of deepest, darkest depths of Europe because um, I think I'd struggle there. So I think I need to go to one of the sort of bigger countries like France or Germany, but obviously much lower leagues. Because, like, realistically, would I want to go to some Eastern European country that I've never heard of or been to? It's a tough one. I'm, I'm undecided. If you want to let me know in the comments and then just say why you think I should go there, that's great. Like, lovely weather, hot women, you know, they've got some nice museums and statues and shit. Oh, come on, Dodd. Play the pass, mate. Stop dilly-dallying. It is a technical term. All the European, all the non-English people are going, what the fuck is dilly-dallying? Just a thing. 
It's just a weird thing. Oh no, that looks dangerous. Is that Gareth Ainsworth? He's 72 years old. Billy Ainsworth with the equalizer. Equalizer. It's an equalizer, people. <sighs> he did well to get there. Pinged it back in. Simple tap in for Ainsworth. No, no. Okay. Is this going to be ours? Are we going to win this header? He's going to hoof it. Oh, he's playing it short. And he's made a mistake. Owen's pounced. <laughs> Should have passed. Should have passed. He got the first one. He thought, I fancy this boss. Right. Anybody really struggling? We've got a few yellow cards, especially in defence, which is not good at all. Both of my fullbacks have got yellow cards. Fun times. Saxon with the corner. Flicked on. Jesus. Okay. It's fine. Um, we're lacking a few players like in depth because of the cup tiredness nature we could go for I think it's lemon time it's a lemon party people um, god these two defenders are so bad <laughs> like, it doesn't matter it's like shit for shit Nice one, Bell. Good win. Lovely turn from Daffy. Plays the ball forward to Owen. Owen's through. Owen's through. Takes it wide. Takes a touch inside. Pokes it. Yes! Second time of asking, but he's got it. Owen with a brace. He's been on deadly form on that last shoulder of the defenders all game long, and they can't handle him. Lovely ball over the top. Keeper makes a good save, but it falls straight back to him, and he volleys it in the corner-ish of the net. 2-1. Come on, boys. I want that cash monies, yeah? Look at the crowd. The crowd is quite big on that left-hand side. I'm a bit nervous now. There's so many people. Right. Daffy with the good tackle again. Owen looking for his hat-trick. But, oh, it's a beautiful forward run to Farah. Farah, not scored many this season. You can see why. Not, not, not really deadly in front of goal. Old Farah, bless him. Corner ball in. Nagy's there. Lovely ball to Farah. Dodd, the new guy. Back to Farah. Oh, that, it's, it's a battle. It's a midfield battle. That's a that is a stunning ball to Demond. He need, he has to wait for support. Oh, Lemon! Yay! Go on, Lemon. Right, 15 minutes left. I'll probably save that sub just in case. We're going to drop it to counter. And we're going to go for a cheeky can't concentrate. Because that's what we do. All right, Frank and the centre-back taking the free kicks. Near post. Surely. Yes, Lewis. I'm not even sure who you are. It's the other centre-back that I brought on. I knew that. Emlyn Lewis. Cheeky. The two centre-backs linking up from the free kick. <laughs> They've been practising that all week. They clearly haven't been practising defending, but they've been practising attacking free kicks, because that's what our centre-backs do. Oh, my God, we've cleared the ball. And Nagy's through. Nagy, God, can he settle it? Surely. Nagy. Oh, my Jesus Christ. How do you hit a ball that badly? It's, it's right in front of you. It's rolling. It's not a volley. It's not a tricky shot, is it? That's embarrassing. But it doesn't matter. We've got through in the cup, and we've got guaranteed cash monies coming in. All right. That'll do. See it out, boys. Owen on form again. He's back in the goals, which we desperately needed. Right, just blow up. Put him out of the misery, yeah? That'll give us good confidence. That means we're unbeaten in five games, people. Five games. It's like Christmas and New Year and birthdays and Easter egg hunts all rolled into one. That's how good this result is. Well done, lads. Everybody's happy. We've got lots of green. That's good. And we're playing real. Oh, cash monies as well. Cash monies. Oh, it's it's quite cool because even if I leave uh, Cardiff Met Uni at the end of the season, I'll know that I've put them in a better, better financial position than when I started. Yeah? They had about 14 grand when I started. Now they've almost got 20. Plus whatever we get in the cup. 
Right, so let's get on to the next game while this loading screen, saving screen is there, because that's always fun to watch. Um, let's go on with the next one. Welcome back. Right, it's game day. Playing against Real. The transfer window is slammed shut. Obviously, we did no late business at all. Um, all good. Uh, we have drawn the cup game, and we're playing Port Talbot. And they're Port Talbot in the division below. And I was thinking, okay, we've got a chance of getting through again. Then I looked at their key player. Just thought I'd look at him. He's on £350 a week. £350 a week. How is that fair? They're in the division below. It shouldn't be allowed. Right, our star man Jake Cook is back in the team. Aaron Lemon's getting a start after his decent sub-performance there. Uh, Linsky and Emlyn Lewis, who scored in that one, they're back in. We made a few changes, but up top we're staying the same. Harry Owen on form again. 13 goals now for the season. One in two It's all you can ask at this level, so I'm very happy with that. Nagy, five in... 13 starts. Not as good. But he's, he's created assist last game, so we'll give him another go. As for the league table, we're playing Rill, who are one position below us. We're 10 points off relegation now with with this many games to go. Nine games to go. So, I'm hoping we should be okay. But we do need to pick up some points. I think this is our best bit of form the entire season. Five games undefeated, yeah. We're in our best run of form, so hopefully we, hopefully, hopefully we can continue that. Right, real are, are pretty shit. Everybody's pretty shit. No offence. It's just a fact, fact of life, really. Um, their man is Robert Hughes. Um, I just like seeing how much they earn, because it's depressing. Um, a central midfielder. He's not that good, actually, to be fair, but he's on 95 quid a week, so well done him. They're playing the 4 5 1. Right, come on, Harry Owen. We need you now. If we can just get like maybe two more wins, we'll be like really nice and secure. But we want to finish, like I said, high up as possible. Um, come on, lads, keep the run going. I was thinking while it was loading, I was thinking about. I'm hoping I've not been linked with any single job yet in the world of football, right? There's no, there's no been no sackings and me favourite to get the job or even a slightest mention of me having another job. But what will be nice, hopefully, if the coming as we get closer to the end of the season, if teams start approaching me, so I'll, I'll give them a lot of credit if a team says, you know, comes and actually wants to sign me, I'll, I'll give them extra bonus points of whether to move to them or not. Right, here we go. First highlight early on, and that's the easiest free kick you'll ever see in your entire life. <laughs> Don't know what quite to say about that. Nobody went with him, as you can see here. Oh, there's just nobody at the back post at all. <laughs> there wasn't even a guy standing next to him when he made his run. No, he was alone the entire time. Okay, but it's an early goal, so we won't worry too much. Look at Bassett. Go down the wing, Luke, charging. Okay, so it's 2-0 with nine minutes gone. But like I said, you know, it's just a freak, freak incident. We'll come back into this. Dinks it in. It's just rolling. It's just rolling. And Lamb just smacks it in. Top bins, just to make sure. Okay, so 2-0 down after, after nine minutes. So, you know, that's going well. Right, here we go. Lemon with the throw. To Owen. We need you in the box, Owen. Get in the box. You're the only person who can score. Oh, it doesn't matter. They'll score for us. It's Newman with an own goal. Lemon's going to get the ball. Oh, teleported. <laughs> nice. Right, 2-1 after 15 minutes. This is a bit more exciting. Owen with a layoff. Lemon pings it in. That's a good finish. Just nippled it into the bottom corner. Loving that finish, Newman. Well done. Okay, so we've not had a shot yet, but we're 2-1. Okay, is, that, is this our highlight? No, it doesn't look like it. Hughes. Intercepted well by Lemon. Owen makes the run. Can he find Nagy? He's probably waiting in the middle. That's a lovely ball across. Oh, what a ball across and what a finish from Nagy. It's 2-all. One shot, two goals. That's just how good we are. He runs over to the massive support here. Cheers. Cheers for coming, lads. They're probably home fans. I think that's more likely to be the away fans. Beautiful ball in from Owen. And Nagy with a delicate finish. Wow. Okay. This is going to be one of them games, is it? Oh, they've got to be distraught. Going 2-0 up after 9 minutes and then being pegged straight back. 
Harry Owen, what a player, what a man. I think we should try and take Harry Owen and Aaron Lemon wherever we go. Even if we're at like Real Madrid. You've got Aaron Lemon coming on for Real Madrid. That'd be absolutely hilarious. Yeah, keep playing. This has been a bizarre game. And uh, passionate. We'll go for a bit. I'm trying to get as much. Any little, any little bonus we can get. Any little bit more green we can get, we'll take. I'm going to go for an assertive, get creative. I don't know why. I'm just am. All right, come on, boys. I need to have a few more shots, though. Shots are important, apparently. I've been told. Probably might go counter-attacking at this stage. Cook heads it away, but it's going to come back. There's the own goal-scoring Newman. Our spy in the ranks. Decent bit of build-up. We should intercept this. Nice. Go on, chase it. Oh, that's a horrific pass. Oh, that could have been a mistake. Bloody hell, suicidal crossfield pass. <laughs> okay, this is quite a long highlight. We've still got a chance to intercept. It doesn't it's looking less likely now. Runner, runner! Spot mark him, somebody mark him. Right, Hartley. Ball down the wing. That's a lovely ball across. Oh, it's a, it's a free tap in. It's a free tap in. James Bell. Is that is he an actor? Well, that was disappointing, that one, boys. I can't, I'm not sure if I can see us coming back from that again. Oh, I keep it almost did well. He's killed himself on the post, but that's fine. It's for the cause. Right. They are the much better side at this point in time. Yes, Farah. Do something useful. Spoke too soon. Don't give it away. Just don't give it away. That's all I'm thinking of. What, oh, see? When I'm managing most teams, when uh, we've got the ball, I'm thinking, go on, ping a good pass. When I'm think when we've got the ball as Cardiff McEwen, I'm just thinking, don't fuck it up. Don't fuck it up. But most of the time, they disappoint me. Okay, this is not good, people. Oh, no, free volley. Oh, good save, Willis. <sighs> the marking. We've got three centre-backs. How are they always unmarked when we have three centre-backs? How does that work? Where what are they doing? Ball in again. Yes, Lindsay's better. Defend it. Get it clear. Yes, nice interception from Cook. Owen. Lovely. You do Owen doesn't lose it. Everybody else. That's a uh, semi decent ball. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. <laughs> right, Lewis. John Lewis. Right, something needs to change here. We are not playing very well at the football. So, 20 minutes. Why not, people? Why not? Right, Bowen, you're just going to have to fill in there, mate. Going for a proper 3-4-3 three, three at this stage. Now, we will go wide midfielders, I think. We don't want to go. We're going attacking. We might, we might as well go for this. We've got to stop playing out of defence. That's our mistake. Stop doing that. Why are we doing that? We're not capable of playing out of defence. Um, okay. Go. We could easily concede another couple of goals with this formation. Give it to Harry Owen. Just somebody pass. Nothing's happening. Harry Owen's injured. A stubbed finger. For fuck's sake. That's not an injury, is it, mate? A stubbed finger. He's going to be out for a week now, isn't he? I bet you. He's going to be out for a week with a stubbed finger. Well, this was a disappointing performance. Really, really bad. I'm not happy at all with this. Alright, come on. I need a little... Just shoot. No, alright. 3-2. Didn't really... Show what the game was about. They deserved to win quite handsomely there. We got very lucky coming back into that game. Let's see how long Harry Owen is out with a stubbed finger, shall we? Better not be long, Harry. If it's more than like a day, I'm going to punch you in the face. Yeah, it was a poor performance. 
He's, he's fine. He's 65%. <laughs> I like that. You stubbed your finger in. That apparently makes you one fit. Ah, oh, no. I wanted to pick up a win there and just... So we know... I want us, I want us to get us safe from relegation as soon as possible. And then we can worry about finishing, you know, in, in sort of halfway or top of the bottom league thing. And now we've split. You know what I mean? Finish top of that league. But it doesn't look like that's going to happen on that performance. I think we might have to change tactics a little bit. I don't know. We only, it's our first defeat in five. Oh, I'm so confused. Aaron Lennon's been is upset because I'm trying to teach him to play a new position. Let's have a look at the. So we're nine points clear. We've got a game in hand over most of those below us. We should be okay. We should be okay. Right, the next game, we'll come back. I think we can't come back for the Welsh quarterfinal, won't we? Because that'll be an interesting one. Um, we'll play a few games off, and then we'll do that. And maybe then the last game of the season. But, right, um, I'm going to say a like target for this video. I'm going to say 298 likes is the target for this video. Because, you know, it's a good number. It's my favourite number, 298. Um... Please do hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new to the place. Um, I will be live streaming tonight. Um, that is tonight as in Monday night. Uh, usually about 10pm or 10.30pm GMT. So please do come by and say hello. It's always good to chat to you guys. Yes, yeah, it's, it's really We have a nice chilled out laugh and a bit of banter. It's very much fun. Very much fun. That's, a, that's an English saying. Um, but yeah. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like. Subscribe. I've already said that. Um, other stuff. Um, comment, what team shall I be? I'm good at this outro stuff. I've always nailed it. I'm, you know, I've uh, definitely got this down now. Right, just, just leave. Just leave me to my waffling. Leave me. That's what I say. My mum says I'm pretty, so fuck you. Bye.